Hey there, it's Binky. So I was recently in Iceland about a week and a half ago, and I'm gonna put up some videos and pictures and also things on my blog about my impressions and food and such, and you know, the things that I visited. But while I was there, I went to um, a grocery store and I wanted to pick up some snacks because I did a lot of hiking. And I came across something that I've seen before because it's from America originally, but um, it's Doritos, but in different countries, they come up with different um, types of Doritos or different flavors that may work for the different cultures. But this one confused me a little bit because it's the cool American flavor. Cool American flavor. So my first thought was, is it like Soylent Green? You know, is it people, specifically American? I went, no, you know, that would be illegal. So. But I still laughed about it. Um, and then I looked at this picture and I was like, that's either going to be sour cream and possibly onion or the ever popular American invention, ranch dressing. But I wasn't sure and um, I had to get it just because of cool American flavor. I didn't even know they put cool and American together when it came to Europe, so I was kind of surprised. But being the American that I am, I was like, I'm picking this up. Great marketing for those visiting the country. But looking at it, I'm almost guaranteeing that this is ranch or sour cream and onion. And, um, you know, it's in English. It's also in Norwegian. It's actually in a few, or not Norwegian, I'm sorry, Icelandic. It's actually in um, a few different languages is great sharing Doritos with the masses but um hmm it kind of smells like um stale cat food I know sorry Doritos cool American flavor so there we go it still kind of smells like that little spice but let's see ranch or sour cream and onion we'll soon find out And it's ranch. Yep, that's what I kind of figured. It's ranch flavor. So, because ranch doesn't really exist in Europe, unless it's an import, they're calling it cool American flavor because ranch dressing probably wouldn't have much of a translation in many other countries. So, in Iceland, it is... um cool American flavor. And I'm trying to see if this is actually a product of Iceland or if it's just in general um, Scandinavia, but I'm having a hard time reading anything. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. It doesn't really say where it's distributed or if it does, I just can't read it. It's Pepsi Cola, Belgium. So they have these in Belgium and then they ship them out to different countries in the region and Cool American was born. It's basically ranch. So if you are an American traveling in um, the northern part of Europe, probably even beyond in the northern part of Europe, maybe all over Europe, you can pick up some cool Americans. And I'm not talking about at the bar. I'm talking about in your grocery store and you can live the, um, the ranch dream. And if you are European, you can also pick some of these up and live the ranch dream if you want to know what it tastes like. Um, but if you're an American living overseas and you're homesick, go pick up some cool American flavor because right here you have your ranch dressing fix. I'm not a big chips fan, but I have to say that ranch Doritos are some of the most addictive things on the planet, but they will make your breath reek for days on end. Guess who's staying in tonight? So that is my review on cool American Doritos. Yeah. Hey, you know, I mean, I'm, I'm kind of like happy that they put that together because, you know, it's one of the only times they put cool and American together. I love that. Who knew? So anyway, that's my review um, with the cool American ranch Doritos. And uh, until next time, have a good one. Bye. <laughs>